Oh, hi, everybody. Welcome to another episode of the Dare John Letter, where you can dare John Dare to dare to do. Um, I want to thank everybody that tuned in last week when y'all saw me wrestle a bear. <laughs> that sure was a lot of fun. <laughs> and we got another exciting adventure lined up for you tonight. You know, um, we've done a lot of challenges over the past few weeks. And a lot of us been like eating hot stuff challenges. I think we've kind of, you know, stretched that to its limits. We've, we've been to the outer edges of the stratosphere, the outer edges of the Scoville sphere. <laughs> we've, we've been there and done that with the hot stuff. I think, it, you know, and it's been extreme to the max. Um, but for tonight, you know, I think we're going to take it in the exact opposite direction. We're going to have an extremely bland challenge. Um, well, it's another, well, it won't be that bland. I mean, we're doing the saltine challenge. Have you heard of this? The saltine <laughs> challenge. Um, and it won't be, you know, all the way bland because it's got the word salt right there in the front of it. And I got to tell you, I think salt might be my favorite flavor, even more so than hot, maybe even more so than sour. But did y'all see my lemon chug challenge? Um, and salt goes good on lemons, but, um, go back and search the hashtag, the dare John letter. You can find all my videos, including the lemon chug challenge. And that time I did the, uh, the ah. just the cinnamon challenge, um, which was another dry challenge. Um, now the saltine challenge, That's great, um, huh? Wikipedia describes it here. We'll go to the iPad to the Wikipedia, um, <laughs> The saltine cracker challenge is a food challenge in which a person has 60 seconds to eat six saltine soda crackers without drinking anything. Now, I haven't been drinking tonight. Um, tonight's episode is rated PG, and uh, we'll, uh, we won't say what that stands for. But there's children watching. I um, want to give a shout out to my nephews and my niece, Ryan Sullivan and Everett and Jacob Sullivan. Uh, thanks for tuning in tonight. Do not try this at home. Um, if you're an adult and you want to grab a box of crackers out of your cupboard and play along at home, you know, that's on you. Um, but uh, The challenge. You know, ask your parents before participating uh, in any of these challenges. Um, be sure to stay tuned after the show for a special message. But for now, we're going to get right to it. Uh, I want to tell you about the saltine challenge. Eat six saltines in uh, 60 seconds without drinking anything, which says here, you know, that may sound trivial, uh, but it's actually very difficult because the crackers quickly exhaust the saliva in your mouth. And even though you can fit six saltines in your mouth at one time, in a minute might be plenty of time to chew, the resulting mass of crumbs is still very swallow, very difficult to swallow <laughs> with a dry mouth. So, um... Anyways, I'm pretty confident I can do six in 60 seconds. That's the challenge. Uh, we are going to use the handy-dandy Rook phone again this week for a timer. We've got it set for a minute. And, uh, you know, if I if I can do more than six in 60 seconds, I will. Um, I may go ahead and eat an entire sleeve. Uh, we'll see how long that takes. But anyway, um, bought these especially for tonight. You may have some in your cupboard at home. Like I said, feel free to join in. Um, these are premium Nabisco. Nabisco, which uh, that's an abbreviation for National Biscuit Company. They were founded in 1989. Really? No, no 1898. There we go. It was 18. They're, they've been around a lot longer now. They actually set up their corporate offices in the world's first skyscraper back in 1898 at, in Chicago uh, at the, uh, the home insurance building there, the world's first skyscraper. And today in Chicago, Illinois, they have um, a 1,800,000 square unit, square feet uh, plant that's the largest bakery in the world. So that's your educational portion of the Ooh. evening. And I just was, I mentioned them, uh, the kids that are tuning in, they made a video, and I've mentioned this the last couple of programs, but I really think it's worth checking out, and it's very entertaining and educational all about explorers mm. so you can find that on my facebook page and uh and it's it's real real uh terrific they did a good job with it and i'm looking forward to hoping they're going to do more, more episodes yeah. soon. all right so um i guess i about run out of stuff to procrastinate with here um <clears throat> we're gonna get the uh do I have any paper towels handy i need some <laughs> Yeah, we do. Here. On the Jameson there. Okay. Snitch about our bottles behind the camera. Uh, here we go. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so here's two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-
four, six. How about that? We're going to do, there's 35 in a sleeve of these. Well, I didn't count them. I did the math. There's, there's five per serving. So I'm actually eating more than the recommended serving size. Um, but, and there's 28 servings of five. So you take that and multiply it more back to school here. Uh, you take 28 times 5 and divide it by 4. There's four Cats. sleeves in a box. And uh, you get 35 crackers per sleeve. All right, well, let's get crack a lacking And uh, I'm going to hit start here as I start to chew. There goes two. I think the trick is doing one at a time. There goes six. Got 24 seconds left. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of dust. You know, I didn't do it. <laughs> I did it three times in a row earlier this week. That was one of those. Woo! So does brand make a difference? Well, mm. I don't know. That was those target brand ones. Ah. They were, <clears throat> they were on sale for 99 cents. Well, that's embarrassing. I did it three times in a row. I sat here in the other chair. Maybe it's the other chair. <laughs> I made a difference. I did it three times in a row. I had... I did it 45 seconds, and I did it in 35 seconds, and I did it in 37 seconds. I'm huh. not kidding. I did it three times in a row with no drink. But, um... I was here it. for that. I, I think I had been drinking that night. I didn't drink anything tonight. I've had a little bit of water. I got water here. I mean, I didn't, I didn't choke He had night. it ready. I had the water ready. I got this strawberry watermelon Gatorade. Just new, I think. I don't know. I just learned about it. It's pretty good. I, I'm not gonna take a drink though. I'm gonna I'm gonna eat the whole sleeve. I'm gonna do this again. Let's try this again. You gonna do it one more? I'm gonna try six again. Hold on a second. Yeah, do you want me to time it, it or? Okay. Yeah, time it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try two at a time this time. I don't remember what I did the other day, but you gotta you gotta get them in a clump and swallow the clump is the trick. I thought I was gonna be doing a lot more now. Okay. All right. Here we go. We got another timer. All right, go. Go. one of the few challenges where I think biting your tongue might help. Most people are saying just cram them all in. Then you're just going to cram them. <laughs> it's hard. There's not really space. Well, <laughs> all right. 35 seconds. Clump, clump sounds like a choking hazard, she says. Who? Brittany Hagen. Hey, <laughs> I'm going to do it. Oh, yeah, he's going to do it. Boom, 50 seconds. <laughs> well, yeah. All right. Boom, did it. 50 seconds. <laughs> 10 seconds, that's fair. That's the worst. So I, did it, I did it so good in the other chair with the, <laughs> I think they were called Marketplace. They were in a red box. If at first you don't succeed, but anyway, let that be a lesson. Well, I think I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit here and leisurely eat the rest of the sleeve um, and not take a drink. But um, we won't keep you all. We'll, we'll call it uh, a win. Well, how about best two out of three? I better do it one more time. <laughs> I better do it one more time. You got be six more for sure. Yeah, there's six more. We're gonna say best two out of three. Then we can say I won this one. We can say conquered. Still no drink. This would probably be good with some Concord grape jelly on it. There's an the inside joke. That's for super promoter. Big Ben. Anyway, so that's that's half sleeve anyway. Well, 16, 35 divided by, it'd be about 16. You can't really divide 35 by 2. Really? 
Yeah, not would, really. No, you'd have to have a calculator, and it'd be like a decimal it'd point. It'd be, yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> it's so raw. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's one way to get your mouth wet. All right, did it. <laughs> Best Golly. two out of three. You got it. All right. <laughs> All right. Um, so anyway, yeah, I hope y'all, maybe let me know how y'all did. If y'all joined in at home with your own saltines there. Um, not as easy as it sounds, we'll say, of the saltine challenge. Um, and uh, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> uh, I think you did good. Yeah. This is probably my second least favorite episode. <laughs> <laughs> um, hey, but they can't all be zingers. I think that was um, pretty... Don't be yep. salty. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, y'all have a good week. We'll see you next time.